Hello. Today we are going to do a fridge organization. To organize the fridge, I bought these containers from Amazon. So far, I am loving them. I bought different sizes for things like berries and so on. I like the fact that the trays are removable when necessary for the produce to be ventilated. And they have ventilation on the side. But what's so special about them, on top of the lid, they have instruction on how to take care of a particular produce. Whether the produce need water or airflow, you got all of this instruction, which I love. They claim to make produce last longer. These came on a set of eight, four big one and four small one. The big white container that you see here in the middle is my eggs container. You will see more of it later. Meanwhile, let's go check out the fridge. I'm giving you guys a little close up. As you can see, the fridge is not organized. No item has a home in there. I'm gonna remove all the foods inside the fridge to give it a good clean. This is my first organization video. I have many more coming up. I'm telling you my friends, your girl needs to organize this house. I would love it if you stick around, not only till the end of this video, but for the other videos coming up. In the fridge, I'm using Dawn soap mixed with water. The fridge wasn't too dirty, so there was no need for me to remove the trays on top. I'm only removing the two drawers at the bottom. I bought this fridge from Home Depot. It is such a cool fridge. I love, love it. It came with so many different apps and I do so much with that fridge, you guys. I have my to-do list, my shopping list. I listen to my favorite artists in Pandora. My favorite of them all, the photo album. A calendar. My kids love to draw on it. The apps in the camera sect and with my phone, you, I can see exactly what's missing when I'm at the grocery store. Hey, you can even watch me on YouTube. If you're looking for something cool for your kitchen, you should definitely check it out. Okay, my friends, this is what we're dealing with. All the foods to put away. I went to do a little grocery shopping this morning, so I have some more on this side. Are you ready? Let the party begin. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm starting with the items that are easier for me to organize. Those that I know I have a specific place for already. I love this egg storage because it can take up to 34 eggs per container. Just saying, we eat a lot of eggs in this house. My fruits and my produce with a little bit of vinegar. I am so happy I found these containers for my fruits and my vegetables. I don't know about you, but I am tired of throwing away my stuff. You guys feel me, right?
I would like to say if you are new to this channel, welcome to the Glam Squad family. I upload Glam home decor and DIY videos. Please take this opportunity to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you can get notified once I upload a new video. And to my existing fellow Glam Squad, thank you so much for all of your support and your love. You guys are the sweetest thing on earth. And if you guys liked today's video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. I use my phone to record my videos and it crashed so you guys will not see me finish preparing the fruits. I am back on the island organizing the rest of the stuff. Not all of my bread goes in the fridge, but some do. At this point, I'm just trying things out because I do not have a specific place for the rest of this stuff. So I'm just trying to see what works and what doesn't work. So this is what we have so far. We have to see how they're gonna fit in inside the fridge. Once again, I'm gonna start with the items that I have an idea where I want them inside the fridge. I'm double checking to make sure nothing is expired. Later on on the video, you're going to see that all these things that I placed on the door were moved to a different location. <laughs> the wine rack, I got it from Amazon as well. I thought it was cute. Okay, this is what we're up to for now. I have a spot for my wines, my milk. On top here, I have my ragu sauce, maple syrup, and garlic. In the middle rack, I have my dressings and continent. And down here, I have my orange juice, lamb juice, and apple cider vinegar. And this is what I have on the other side of the door. We don't really eat cheese, that's all I have. I put it in there. Coconut cream, my butter, some more garlic. And yeah, I know I started this diet recently that explains why I have a lot more vegetables and healthier food. But the concept is still the same. Yeah, I can use the containers for whatever you have in your fridge. I'm labeling the containers using that Sharpie marker that I got from Amazon. It is easily washed out. Labeling them gonna help me a lot when my husband is putting things inside the fridge for me. And it makes it look fancy. <laughs> a challenge that I'm facing right now is making sure that items like grapes, milk, bread, yogurt, orange juice, eggs, because it likes to cook, are at a reachable level for my six year old. We did a little test to make sure he can reach. So far, so good. A little tip to make sure that your pasty or herbs last a long time, just have it sit in some water before putting it inside the fridge. Change the water once a week, it will last you a very, very long time.
kids loved the fact that everything was labeled. Look, I put an extra A in salad. It better makes me extra skinny. <laughs> Last but not least, the leftovers. There's no organization without making sure that we have a spot for our leftovers. My little chicken pot from Maniana, they all fit back there. Hoo hoo! <laughs> yeah, I know I'm dramatic. I've always wanted to have my fridge looking like a picture on Pinterest. Honestly, I didn't know it was that easily attainable. I label the trays on the door as well. Why not? Drum roll, please. Ta-da! <laughs> I'm having too much fun. In this mason jar, I have leftover chopped onion in there. In this drawer, I have oranges, plantain, lemon, and lime. And in this one, I have ginger, corns, and extra pepper that couldn't fit in the container. I love the fact that everything is visible and easily accessible. My beautiful friends, please give today's video a thumbs up and share it with all of your friends and your family. Be sure to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you don't miss anything as soon as we upload. I thank you so much for spending your time with me today. I look forward to seeing you on my next video. I love you so, so much. Mm -hmm.